Hello everybody, I'm back again here to do another video. Um, before I get to this video, I do have some unfortunate news. The creator of Spongebob, even though I don't really watch the show anymore, but I'm still going to do this video anyway. The creator of Spongebob, Steven Hillenburg, unfortunately passed away. So, uh, in his honor, I'm not going to show everything Spongebob related, but I am going to show all my video games I have for Spongebob. These I've had for a, for a long time, most of them. And, uh, we're going to start things off with Spongebob Squarepants Super Sponge for the PlayStation. Looks like I got a new notification from YouTube, which I'll check that out. So I may check that out later. But this is the only, uh, Spongebob game that was ever released for the PlayStation 1. I don't think it's very well liked by some people, but I, but, uh, I do have the game anyway. And uh, next, we're going to show off the one and only Game Boy Advance title I have, which is, for the Spongebob series, which is Spongebob Revenge of the Flying Dutchman. And you can actually see it pretty good with this camera. Next up, we're going to go to the, to the other console ones. Starting off with, and these are in alphabetical order, at least three of them are, Spongebob Battle for Bikini Bottom, which could be the best Spongebob game ever made. This one is complete. All of these are, I think, except for the Game Boy Advance one. And, of course, we have the game based off the movie, the Spongebob Squarepants movie, which is... Uh, Basically the same thing, I guess, as the uh, Spongebob Battle for Bikini Bottom. Except the way you select the levels and stuff, I believe. is probably the only difference. And you can play as Patrick in both of these, actually, I believe. But the, in this one, you can also play as Sandy. Next up, and I already showed it for the Game Boy Advance. Spongebob Squarepants Revenge of the Flying Dutchman for the PS2. And... For the Nintendo GameCube. That's the same game, really. Uh, this one, though, for the PlayStation 2, is one of the purple discs. Here, let me show you. As you can see, there's the purple layout right there. And, uh... There's not a whole lot of purple disc PS2 games. And as a bonus, I'm going to show off, a, not necessarily a Spongebob game, but it does have Spongebob in it, Nicktoons Unite. This one also has Timmy Turner, Jimmy Neutron, and Danny Phantom on it. And I have actually never finished this. I think it's been a long time since I played it, though. Well, that'll do it for this video. I'll see you all for the next one.